Namaskar. This is Sadiksha Lohani from the Excelsior School, and I'm so fortunate today to speak on the topic space and entrepreneurship as a ninth grader. To explore the strange new worlds, to seek out new life and new civilization, to boldly go where no man has gone before, space, the final frontier, said Captain Kirk. These words, extracted from Star Trek, they serve as a way of underlining how detrimental the space industry is to us. Space is as captivating as it was when Neil Armstrong took a giant leap for humanity and stepped the first foot on moon. It is just as fascinating to the 12-year-old obsessed with Star Trek and to the 60-year-old equally obsessed with entrepreneurship. But there's a question, or perhaps a commonly raised concern, that uh, in a world where entrepreneurship can be chalked up to tourism or anything of less risk, why bring space, the risky space, into the equation? Well, about 10 years prior, space was solely the province of governments. Only governments could give the exceedingly deep budgets and the scientific investments and not to mention the power so required for space exploration or any sort of technology so required. The first moon landing, the first human space flight and other pioneering events helped to define the, spa the term space in the past. Additionally, uh, national scientific institutions like NASA were in charge of space initiatives completely. Looking at the opportunities today, the situation is completely contradictory as governments are no longer in charge of the space industry today. However, individuals like Elon Musk, uh, Sir Richard Branson, Jeff Bezos, and so many other technology entrepreneurs and technology experts, um, as well as new space firms like SpaceX and the Virgin Galactic, have come to represent space. These business owners and organizations are responsible for the monetization of space, further broadening the entrepreneurship oppor opportunities in space. An example of this is SpaceX landing and reusing the rocket stages to reduce the cost of launches um, and thus enabling cheaper and faster access to space. Entrepreneurs in the space industry take advantage of the chance to address previously unsolved issues by the governments and profit from the foresight. Anything that is launched into space needs to be durable, uh, light, uh, extremely energy efficient and not to mention long lasting. This creates opportunities for innovation in industries such as manufacturing, rare materials, launch services, and um, earth observation, navigation, as well as communication, and like so much more. According to NSR, nearly $1.7 billion were spent in the new space ventures just in 2017, which is absolutely insane and just showcases how vast space uh, space entrepreneurship and space innovation really can be. The history of space exploration has been punctuated by achievements uh, from the Apollo moon missions to the Mars rovers. These missions were primarily led by government agencies. However, the 21st century has ushered in a new era where entrepreneurship is propelling to new heights, especially in the space industry. Entrepreneurship, it thrives on innovation and space exploration. It demands cutting edge technology. The development of lightweight materials, robotics, and so much more, it not only impacts our understanding of the cosmos, but also has a significant impact on industries here on Earth, which is absolutely insane because we, the specs of the specs of universe are helping advancing helping in the advancement of exploration of the uh, entire universe, which is absolutely insane and really shows how much powerful human knowledge and human entrepreneurship really can get. From the, uh, the, from the commercialization of the space travel to the extraction of extraterrestrial resources, it shows that uh, entrepreneurs and visionaries uh, are at the forefront of shaping the future of uh, space exploration. As we look to the future, it is apparent that the new wave of entrepreneurs will play a pivotal role in shaping the space industry. So keep your eyes open on the stars because the cosmos offers a universe of opportunities waiting to be explored. Together, we can make the final frontier, frontier the entrepreneurial frontier. Thank you.